music are you listening to? What's in your iPod? I have music from uh, West Side Story because I had the tremendous experience of getting to play the world premiere of West Side Story, the score with film. It was the first time it had ever been done with the film above us. It was with the LA Philharmonic, the Hollywood Bowl. It was a tremendous percussion section. I, anyone who's seen the movie knows that there's the music is just incredible. I mean, it's one of the seminal American works of music ever. And then I have a lot of music from uh, the uh, Charlie and Eddie Palmietti, who are their uh, Afro-Cuban jazz uh, legends. And they have uh, one of my sort of hobbies, if you can call it a hobby since it's still drum related, but the nice thing about being a percussionist is you can have hobbies within your field. And so I've been, over the last um, year and a half or so, I've been trying to improve my Afro-Cuban hand percussion skills. So the best way to kind of get better at that is not only to practice it, but to listen to the music. So I have And then I have... Um, the album by Muse, um, uh, Black Holes and Revelations, which is a tremendous album. Anybody who likes Muse, I mean, that's more recent, but but that's really great. I also have yeah. Mozart Requiem because my uh, my teacher, or not my teacher, one of my students was working on the Mozart Requiem on timpani, and so I brought it in to plug into my amp. So when he was taking a lesson, we could kind of listen to it and play, and I could kind of show him how to uh, uh, articulate on the timpani to reflect what's going on in the music.